Hi everyone, welcome to day 39 of my 50 days SQL challenge series where I solve data analyst and business analyst interview question for SQL. Today we will be solving one of the Amazon data analyst interview question that was asked very recently to one of my subscribers. So here is the question, write a SQL query to show each product category and its return percentage. Return percentage equals total return by that category divided by the total overall returns multiply with 100. Now let's see the expected output one we need to basically find the category so name of the product category and return percentage these are the two things that we need now let's see the table that we have we have two tables the first table that we have which is amazon product table that has a product information like product id product name category name price and country now the second table that we have basically the return records so that has basically the product informations and the return informations so we have return id order id product id return reason and the return date now the common column that we have between these two table are basically this column which is product id in this table now you can also see the product id in the amazon product table which is here you can see the product id so let's write down the things that we need to solve this questions so first we need to basically find out the product category name that we can get from this amazon product table so first we need basically the category category name okay so this is what we need first things and then we basically need the total returns right total returns so we can get the total returns from basically this uh, table which is basically return records now what you need is basically third basically each product category and what is their return so we can go ahead and say each category return we need isn't it so we can make a join between these two table based on the product id and we can basically get each product category and this return numbers return count right so this is how we will be getting each product category and the return count so till now it is very simple it's fine now next what we need is basically we need to find out this return percentage so we need to basically divide this total returns okay total returns and by basically each product category count we need to divide this basically each product category count by the total returns and multiply with 100 that is how we will be getting the return percentage at the end we simply need to return basically this category name and this return percentage first we will need basically each product category name basically this column which is from category now this column is coming from where which is basically amazon products right so till now it's very simple now what are the things else i need is basically so i'll be joining this table which is amazon product table with this return table so i'll just call it s a p and this one i'll call it as r that means return records table now what is the conditions they both have basically same column which is basically product id right so i can go ahead and say ap dot you can see it's already coming product id dot rp dot product id so till now it's, it's fine now i'm getting this product category from where product category from my first table which is ap so i'm going to say ap dot product category now next what i need is basically i need to find out the returns right so whatever the counts i have in this table for that product category i mean one record basically shows that one return two records shows that two returns so basically i can go ahead and say count of basically what count of everything now this everything is count coming from where this coming from basically the return table which is rr so i can go ahead and say basically rr dot star or one so that means everything count everything for that particular category now at the end i need to do a group by because group by by this category then only i can see the total number of return right so now let's run the query to see the product category and their total return so if i run this query i can see each product category name and the number of return basically we have in those product category now i can see all the product category name and their number of returns now we need to find this a return percentage first we need to see what is the total number of returns we have so if in case we want to find a total number of returns we can basically use this query and here i can go ahead and say count count of basically everything so that's how i get the total number of returns from this table so total number of return we have which is 35 this uh, you know count of return which is basically which tell us basically the total returns for this particular product category we can divide it by this total return right now now this total return i can put in a sub query because now for each product category i need the total return which i'm getting from this uh, you know query now i need to divide that by the total returns overall returns right so i'll be using a sub query inside the sub query i'm just going to put this basically the count of you know count of star from this return so this is going to return me basically what the total number of returns from the main table without basically any product category 
now till now this is very fine i can simply now go ahead and basically kind of you know multiply with 100 so that is how i should be getting my results but we may get a conversion error because we need to convert this number into numeric and this number into numeric then only we can multiply with 100 so first let's just run and let's see what happens okay now you can see we are getting this 000 so basically we are getting a no return percentage but which is incorrect so that means we need to we're getting a division error we're getting a division error so i need to convert it by using double column and then i need to write numeric so if you're using postgres sql this is the functions or you can use a typecast in mysql or other rdpms i will also convert this into numeric and multiply with 100 now if i run this query i will see each product category and their basically percentage of return in the overall return now you can see now we can just do a order by we can just do a order by and we can just give a nice name to this column i can just go ahead and say s and i can give a name call basically percentage percentage return right so now we can just do a order by which is to descending so we can see the category that has the highest percentage of return in the overall return so let's just run this query now you can see that we have this headphone category which has the 17 percent return so these are the these are the three category which has the highest return percentage now this camera and other category basically has the little lower return percentage so this is how you can solve this type of interview question that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching the video till the end if you want to practice the same questions download the data by going into video descriptions i have added my github link just click the link download the data copy paste into your code editor and run the query to create the table like this uh, this query and then you can basically practice this uh, questions that's it for this video thank you so much for watching the video have a good day see you tomorrow